Hey guys, Frostbox here, and welcome back to my Pokemon Leaf Green Randomizer Nuzlocke. Alright, let's see, uh, in the last episode we caught Moltres, and that was a good catch too, and that was back on Mount Ember, and that was good, and before that we caught Articuno in the Seafoam Islands, and now we're here to catch Zapdos today. And he is in the power plant, which is just south of Rock Tunnel. And that's what we're going to do today. Cool. As for this area, I'm pretty sure I've caught a Pokemon here. Probably quite a while ago, but yeah, we've done that. So let's just go over my Pokemon. Alright, we've got Venusaur on level 46 with Bullet Seed, Razor Leaf, Poison Fang, and Frenzy Plant. Okay, next is Lapras on 46 with Water Pulse, Surf, Ice Beam, and Overheat. Then we've got Jolteon on 47 with Shock Wave, Charge, Thunder Punch, and Thunderbolt. Then we've got Typhlosion on 47 with Flamethrower, Strength, Heatwave, and Fire Blast. Then Lugia is on 46 as well, uh, with Water Pulse, Aerial Ace, Mist Ball, and Fly. And there's our Lickitung, he's on 45, with False Swipe, Heatwave, Glare, and Rock Smash, which we gave him in the last episode as well. That is it. Cool. Alright, once we've caught Zapdos, and in the next episode or two, we might switch up my party a little bit as well. Alright, so what we'll do... I will need a... Um, repel, Max Repel. Cool. Surf, and we go straight down. There we go. Ooh, he might be a trainer, is he? He is. All right, we'll fight him. Pokemaniac. Two Pokemon. Trotius. Cool. Poison Fang should take care of him. He's only 29. So the Pokemon here could be a little weaker, maybe. Bayonet. We'll switch, we'll go to Jolteon. Uh, Shockwave. Got him. Awesome. Okay, that's done. Here we are. This is the power plant. Cool. Alright, we'll jump straight in. Uh, I've got a max repel on, so we're all good there. Here's an item. Hardstone. That's for rock-type Pokemon, I believe. Okay, we've got a repel, so we shouldn't get any battles. We'll try and catch Zapdos. It's been quite a while since I've done these, so I may get a little lost. There's an item over there. 
This is an item. Oh, I forgot about these electrodes. Let's say because these electrodes look like items, and we might pick more than one up, so we're not going to catch them because I want Zapdos to be the catcher for this area. So these electrodes we're not going to include it as Pokemon. Can't escape. Well, we're going to try and escape. There we go. So the Pokeballs that look like, well, that are electrodes, we're not going to include them as Pokemon because we're going to catch Zapdos. And there could be quite a few of them. I forgot how many electrodes there could be. Anyway, that's an item. I'm pretty sure most of them are items, but probably a good 40% of them will be electrodes. I think. I could be a little wrong. Here's another repel. Yeah, so the electrodes we're not going to include. Oh wow, really? There's Zapdos already. No trainers, no nothing. Well, let's see if there's any more items hanging around. To be honest, I remember puzzles in this place, but obviously not. Anyway, we might as well go back and pick up all the items we can. There's a TM12, self-destruct. Pearl War off. We we'll use another one. Surprise is no, not even one trainer, that's very surprising. A Firestone. Yeah, I really thought there were puzzles and trainers in here, but can't be. That is, that's the entrance, okay. Nothing else. Uh, so this is another electrode, so we'll run away from them. Yeah, it has been a long time since I catch these birds. It was probably back on the original red and blue days. I don't think I've never done it on leaf green or fire red. There you go. Well, there's obviously no trainers or anything. Sky uppercut. Okay, cool. Pearl War off. Alright, we'll use one more. I guess we're heading for Zapdos. This might be a short episode. I've been there. Did we go down? Oh, I can't go any further. Oh well, looks like we're heading straight for Zapdos. Nothing else to do here, obviously. Alright, here we go. Here we go. And here is Zapdos, level 50. I wonder if I should try a bullet scene. Mm, maybe not. Let's switch.
Who should I bring out? Let's go Lapras. Well, actually, that's probably not a good choice. Lowered its head. That's for um, Skull Bash, I think. Water Pulse, Surf, Ice Beam. We'll switch again. Go to Jolteon. I might try a shockwave, seeming he's electric, it shouldn't do too much. Hopefully. Ooh, Volt Absorb. Good. Healed me. Excellent. Alright, let's do that again. Shockwave is 60, Thunder Punch is 75, and that's 90, okay. I might try one more. Hopefully it doesn't kill it. Okay, good. Let's just heal. Fresh water, what about a soup potion? There we go. Volt tackle. Great, we absorb that. Awesome. Cat Ultra Ball. Two, three, we got him! How good is that? First try, excellent! And there is Zapdos. Awesome! Done with the power point. To be honest, I thought there would be a lot more to do in there. But apparently not. So, let, what we'll do, let's fly. Might go to, might go to Cinnabar first. First thing will heal. All right, now we'll check. We'll check out Zapdos. Pokemon, let's have a look. Summary. Okay, Zapdos is a jolly nature. Stats. Stats are pretty good, actually. He 
has Mirror Move, Skull Bash, Vault Tackle, and Bubble Beam. Bubble Beam, that's a bit weird. Alright, go to Moltres. Moltres is a lax nature. Stats also pretty good. Sunny Day, Feather Dance, Mirror Move, and Flame Wheel. Cool. Oh, that's the Curlier. That's the Drowsy. We can probably um, get rid of. Articuno. Special Attack's not bad. His Attack's not the best, but... Ice Beam, Dragon Claw, Mirror Move, and Constrict. They all have Mirror Move. Cool. Now, this Drowsy was actually a miscatch, so I think we'll uh, release him. Okay, we'll move him. Alright, let's have a look at my party. Well, let, why don't we change our Pokemon now? So let's go from. So we've got Venusaur, Lapras, Jolteon, Typhlosion, Lugia, and Lickitung. Lickitung's pretty good for catching Pokemon. And he has Rock Smash now, and Typhlosion has Strength. Mind you, none of them are dead yet. And as for dead Pokemon, I have 12. These are the ones I can use. Well, we got some good choices. And I've still got to get my 8th badge yet as well, so... I wonder what level they are at the gym. I reckon they'd be around 48, 50 as well. Tricky, tricky. Let's get out of there. I do have a pretty good team. What I might do, I might wait till after the gym and see if we don't lose any Pokemon. It might be a better strategy. Okay, we're on Cinnabar. I think we're pretty right for items. Even max repels, we should be right. Hyper potions. I have 13. That should be enough. Alright, well, we can't do anything here, so let's fly. To Viridian City. Pearl Wharf, that's fine. Alright, yeah, we can now go into the gym. Alright, you know what? I'm think I'm gonna end this episode right here. I know it's a bit of short, bit of a short episode, but I thought the power plant would be longer. And if I do the gym, that could take a little while, especially if we lose Pokémon. So what we'll do, we'll keep this team until after the gym, and we'll see if we lose any. And if we do, we'll swap them out. If, even if we don't, we'll swap them in the next episode, I think. And then we could probably head this direction.
to head towards uh, Victory Road then. Alright, well, I know it's been a bit of a short episode, but I think I'm going to leave the episode right here. We'll take on the gym next time. Alright guys, uh, thanks for watching. Leave a like, comment, subscribe and everything. And I'll see you next time when we take on the gym. Cool. Alright guys, see you later.